Hello once again everyone and welcome back to Let's Play uh, Colonization, Civilization 4 Colonization. Um, in our last part we uh, kicked the pants off of the French, although they do have one new settlement down here that I am going to let go because there's no reason to really go after it. Um, so we'll be fighting, or we won't be fighting them really anymore unless they prove to be a problem. Um, what I'm going to be looking to do in this uh, section of the LP is to kind of shore up our uh, settlements here, uh, get them up and running. Um, this, this, and this one were all plunked down right the close to the end of the last part. Um, so I want to get them up and going, both in terms of the people that they have in them and the buildings that they have in them. Uh, so they can begin producing the resources that we need, and then we can begin distributing those and selling those back to the homeland to finally start getting our economy up and going properly. Because mostly the money that we've been getting has been coming from exploration and uh, visiting the native villages, uh, which is fine. Problem is, that's only one-time bonuses, and we don't really have anything to support that once that runs out if we don't have our economy up and going. So, we're going to be looking toward doing that in this part, and uh, yeah. Let's uh, get things going. Uh, turns over, the little dot's red. It means there's no one else that can move. So there we are. Um, who are you? Oh, right. You were a soldier. Right. Okay. Uh, so we're going to have a bunch of people graduating from the school there fairly shortly. Um, we've got you coming in. Um, depending if I want to move you out here. Oh, shoot. No, good. Okay. Um, do I want to move that tobacconist out there? No, I think I'll leave you in the shore village for now. Um, then, what we're going to do, sail down here. Uh, cool, that's nice. do need to buy some new tools when I next go back to England, because uh, we're almost out of that. Hooray, a fisherman! Hooray, another fisherman! Cool. That's cool. Um, let's see. you over here too. Okay, cool. Now what I want to do is start connecting these settlements. Yep, learn. I'd be honored. Teach me how to plant okay. sugar. Uh, stand there. Yes, governor. Um, and your job is to connect that. You're sailing down to Plymouth to pick up more people. Build a fort. Need you on lumberjack duty, my friend. Lock those. Very good. Oop. I want you, please, colonist. Get on the boat. Go this way so that you can learn how to farm, and we'll stick you on that corn. Hooray! Sugar! Um, cool, thanks. Hey, I didn't know the expert sugars were ladies. That's interesting. Uh... Fish. People farm. Learn among the natives. i to be honored. And let's go back and drag your ore off. Veteran. And keep exploring. Oh dear. Okay. Um. You, I want to go learn how to f fish. Okay, good. You've connected that. Lovely. Um. Bring you up here, and you can build a lodge up there. Load up all that ore. Uh, 
camouflage, please. Thank you. Can Rowan in? Oh. Then stop doing that. Okay. Bring you up this way. you grow food then for the moment anyway unload load up Turn up. Hmm. I'm gonna take you and I'm gonna take you get on the boats get on the boat you sail down this way. You sit tight for a while. You come down here. Alright, we've got uh, our people farms up and going, which is good. Uh, I want you... I want you on lumberjack duty. Stop! Stupid people. Here, you do that for now. And lock in place. Unload. You get on the boat. You guys start fishing. And... Gotta go up and dump you in Roanoke. You join the town. You take more veteran. Hooray! We've met the Spanish. The last of the, uh, non... Or the last of the, uh, European settlers. Okay. What I need you to start doing is to start making, um... Farms around. Yep, that's nice. Oh, for the love of God. My people farms are too productive! <laughs> I can't st I can't get them going. I got them going too quickly. Now I have nothing to do with all these people that I'm producing. That's nice. Build a farm. Uh, you head over here. Good day. You join the settlement. I want you on rum production. I want you on farming. Yeah, cool. Good day. And then I want you to come down this way, and we're gonna grab that farmer. Uh, join up. I want you down here, building that rum distillery. And you're gonna head south. Stop. Stop trying to starve the city. You on cotton planting again? There we are. We're seeing 28 food a turn. Stupid ridiculous. money. I cannot wait till I get a galleon. Okay. And you 
need to put a farm up here too. Uh, you need to learn how to farm. There, and let's load up. Hello. Sail back to England, please. Um, I'm gonna go with a the schoolhouse next, so I can start training people. Um. One thing you can do, like how I've been sending people off to the natives, um, you know, in the various native settlements, teach them how to gather raw resources. Uh, if you build a schoolhouse, you can teach them to do anything that you have in that settlement. So if I have, you know, a weaver here and a tobacconist and a farmer, I can create a weaver, tobacconist, or farmer in this settlement. Um, and Jamestown is looking like it's going to eventually be my major trade port. Um, so we'll, we'll work on that as the time approaches. Um, yep, let's make a warehouse then. Hooray! Sell off all that garbage. And buy... Ooh, I'm gonna take that... I'm gonna buy that galleon before I lose all that money. So we'll send another shipment over fairly shortly. I would be honored. Alright, so I need to start getting tools in there, which is fine. Um, let's go with a printing press. You come that way. You go that way. Oh, God. Um, I need tobacco planters and cotton planters. Sugar farmer. Oh, the French put another settlement down here. My god. Okay, there's a cotton and tobacco. 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 Why are all the tobacco ones up here? Whatever. Okay, well, you're gonna get on the boat. Where is he? Yes. There he is. Good day. You're gonna get on the boat. Come down this way. Okay, I'm going to get a farmer in there, I'm going to put a farmer there too, once we get those up and going, um, well, it didn't take long at all, uh, let's go with a rum, nope, nope, didn't want that, changed my mind, it was the wrong choice, uh, my printing press, there it is. Um, put that there. Lovely. You can wait until they pick up more thing. And Roanoke has cotton. Okay. So, we're going to use one of our yes. wagon trains to go pick that up. Pick up the cotton. Actually, this might be a good time to set up some trade routes. Uh, governor. Exports. Cotton, all of it. And Roanoke, export. Cotton. And Jamestown, import. Cotton. Very good. And then we will uh, choose trade routes for you to go on, and you will zip around collecting resources for us to sell back to the home country. Hooray! Rid of all that. Go back. Oh god, okay. Yeah, whatever. Should produce another person shortly. Plymouth has produced another person, and nobody was surprised. <laughs> um I don't know, I guess there? Go for it. Alright, Weaver, go back to weaving. Hey, there we go. And we got a 
lumberjack. Hooray! Good day. Get over there. And you guys get to sail around the world. By around the world, I mean over here. I want you up there. Buy two sets of tools and we'll bring this guy back. And the Dutch are pressing us. That's obnoxious. Um, oh, wow. Okay. Uh, let's see who the natives have gone to war with each other. It's fun. Jack. Okay. Can you start producing sugar yet? You can without crashing it? Brilliant. Uh, I'm out of tools. Let's start with a... I don't know, I suppose a printing press. Nope, can't afford a war. Leave me alone. I have no interest in your native conflicts. Yes, I know, thank you. I'm working on it. Okay, so this settlement's pretty much set up. Uh, so let's start moving into this one and get this guy set up and going. Alright. Unload. Yes, governor. I want you over there. I'm taking one of these boxes of tools. And you require two twenty. Okay. Take you. Put you in Roanoke. All right. Cool. Take this rum. Bring it back. This way. Hooray! And load. Um, so let's sell some cotton off too, because it looks like we're getting that kind of quick. We're not really getting rid of it fast enough. So, sail on home. Let's go for a weaver's shop. So, Scout explored everything? Did the Spanish open up their borders to us? No. Um, I want you to go back up here. Let's see if we can't get an open border agreement with them. Unload. And stay here for now. Yes, I know. Going and buying more stuff. Oh, God. I was really ramping up the taxes. Yep. As you wish. Ooh, hello. <coughs> Oh shoot, I don't even have enough for food ne or to produce anything anymore. Well, you stay there for the moment then. Um, sure, join the settlement. You join the settlement as well. Oh, grow food. If you're starving, gr don't switch it on to not food. Stupid thing. Alright. Need more tools. Come back. Uh, oops, nope, didn't want that. I wanted the yes, pioneer. Governor. Build me a farm! Okay. Quebec is out of stuff for the fort. So let's send you down to learn how to farm as well. Yep, I know. that way. And you 
We'll sail up this way. Oh dear. They're really starting to push us in terms of borders. I should probably get some people in the town hall fairly sh soon, because otherwise they'll just crush us with borders, which is what the Dutch are doing up here as well. Um... Good day. Oop, nope. Good day. Get off. I wanted you to load goods, not load onto something. Okay. Let's get you. Get some stuff out to you as quickly as possible. Uh, take that rum, take that cloth, and take the rest of that rum. Go back. Uh, I don't know. Church? Why not? Uh, farm, please. Learn. Yep, thank you. Good god, the Aztecs are going crazy. Unload fort. And we're going to change the production to that printing press. And you are going to be in here. You are... Yeah, you'll just finish the next turn. So let's start pushing the borders back. And... I suppose I could dump the rest of these off in here. Yeah, because you're going to need them anyway. Alright, back to the main one. Main settlement. Yeah. Oh god, stop raising my taxes so much. Now I know how the colonists felt. Because this is really annoying, having <laughs> uh, this much problem with uh, tax increases and whatnot. Okay, the king, as we continue to get more rebel settlement uh, sentiments, and so that's what we're doing here, we're trying to push back the borders, uh, as we've just done, maybe we'll continue pushing a little bit more. Um, the king will put more people into the uh, rebel settlement um, squad, I suppose, would be the best way to put it, um, because he is concerned that people are wanting to rebel against him, which, you know, stands to reason. Um, so he'll be doing that while we uh, try to pop our borders like that. Um, hmm. I guess a lumber mill. Sell all that off. Buy some more tools. Uh, yeah, let's go there. Ooh! Ah! Our treasury's evil. Ah! Oh my god. So many people. Um, what do I have in here? I don't know what to do with some of you guys. Let's. Might have to start expanding again. I'll hack off the natives and everything, though. Let's look at the settlements. Um,. Yeah, you're just a collection of whatever. So let's say, let's put you over here in Soldier's Point. Because you're going to have enough farms to be able to support yourselves, I think. I want you to go this way. And you can just walk back, because I'm going to use my boat for other more important people. Come down here. Uh, yep, I know. Thank you. Do we want more people? No, absolutely not. <laughs> we have plenty of people. Thank you. Um, no, you will new. Um, actually, you could use this settlement could use some people. We can start building in it. Oh God. Uh, let's have you over here, fishing perhaps. Move you down this way. Stop it! Stop raising my taxes! I've never seen him raise taxes this aggressively before. That's ridiculous. 
much are you producing? You're producing three over. Okay, so you're fine. You're certainly fine. You are in need of somebody who knows how to farm so that those other people can be freed up for other things. Um, I guess just wait there for now. Uh, let's see. So it gets a free promotion uh, of Grenadier 1, which provides settlement attack bonuses for all of my gunpowder units. For all my troops, essentially, is what it's going to come out to be. So yeah, I'd like free upgrades. That would be nice. Okay. Your job is to build. And yeah. Uh, unload... Put a hundred of these onto that. Gonna run you up this way. Unload, build a fort. There we go. And let's run and get anything that uh, the rum that you're producing. Yeah, you're producing rather a lot of rum now. Load that, and you can wait until we get the rum over. Um, not at the moment, thank you. Uh, defensive packs mean that if I get attacked, or if he gets attacked, the other of us will spring to the other's defense. Um, but I don't really want to deal with that at the moment. Uh, one, it's only one person, or one settlement that I found. Maybe there's some stuff over here, uh, that I've not seen, but... One, it's only one, so it's not really worth it. And two, if he gets if he gets attacked by Monty, since Monty's gone attack crazy, um, then that would mean I have to fight Montezuma, and I don't want to really do that. <laughs> Thank you very much. <clears throat> Let's load up the rum. Send you off that way. <laughs> I don't know, um... I guess... Lumber... why not? Lumber mill. Let's go. Okay. You, grow food. You, unload. You, load up. Grab that cloth, grab that rum, grab that other rum. And send, send back. Okay. Hmm. Wondering how best I can try to continue optimizing. Who's on deck in Europe? Nobody that's really worth anything. So what I might start doing is buying guns and bringing them back, just in case of any uh, native attacks, but also um, any... Uh, yeah, I want to keep you guys there. How many hills do I have? Can I start blacksmithing? Might be able to start getting away with blacksmithing a bit. Yeah, because if I pull you out, Mr. Expert or Miner, that won't destroy that settlement, which is nice. And... Hmm. Let's get gun production going in Quebec. No, because you're going to have more... Oh, no, because you can always ship the ore out. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll get gun production going in Quebec.